If any young people are thinking about going into the law, you know, I would highly recommend it. It's a difficult career. You know, I had moments throughout my career where I thought, wow, this is very stressful. You know, I had difficult clients at times. I had uh, to appear in front of judges who I thought <laughs> were, were hard. Um, so it's not, you know, it's not an easy career, but I think that, that it's a very rewarding thing to do. And I think just um, law school and the practice of law does help you think in a very logical manner and helps you to become a much better problem solver, just in general. So, um, you know, I, I recommend it to people who are interested in it. And then in terms of, you know, whether a person can ever become a Supreme Court Justice, it is a little bit like um, you need to be in the right place at the right time um, because it's a, a position that many people desire and um, there are many, many qualified people who could, who could do this position. So my best advice is to get yourself ready by getting a broad uh, swath of experience and um, then you just need to try. And I think sometimes people who are shy or maybe people who get rejected once, you know, think, oh, that's it, it didn't work for me. But I, I think if, there, if it's something you really want to do, you need to try and try in a, in a persistent fashion. In my case, it took three tries to get to the, the third try was the charm. Um, and I think it's um, really, you know, it's so worthwhile to do it. And I think it's really important not to take it personally if you, if you get rejected the first time because there's so much that a, that a governor uh, needs to keep in mind about when, when he or she is appointing people to the court that, it, you know, it's always best not to take it personally. Pick yourself up, keep going, and keep applying if you really want to do it.